Okay, the time has come to uh, try and start the car. I must admit I'm pretty nervous actually. Um, so got the fire extinguisher ready <laughs> just in case anything goes badly wrong. Um, but we'll give it a go. Some, uh, got some smoke coming up but as you can see it does run um, I might just be burning oil or something off the manifold so um, the exhaust is rattling which was my concern um, I can hear it rattling a lot inside so I'm gonna have to figure that out I just don't seem to be able to get the clearances right under the body of the car so uh, I'll fiddle around with that for a bit and see if we can get that sorted and then the other thing I want to check is that I haven't got any um, fluid leaks anywhere. So I'll do that next. As you can see, the oil pressure is steady at 75. Um, it's, running, it's running a bit uneven. They always do where they've been remapped. Uh, they run uneven until they get hot. It's been a bit smoky out this side, it just set off my um, smoke alarm in my garage um, but I can't see any fluid leaks so I think it's just, um, you know, where it's uh, got new components on it and uh, probably got a bit of grease and whatnot on it which is burning off so it seems okay. I uh, can't find any fluid leaks. Um, the steering, powered steering fluid dropped a lot which didn't surprise me because, um, yeah, it's dropped again. So um, it's obviously a lot of air in there. See all the bubbles. <laughs> uh, so I can top that up um, and bring that up back up to the right level. Um, other than that, I'm pretty pleased, quite honestly. Um, that's pretty good. Pretty good. What I'd like to do now is um, I need to sort out the rattle on the exhaust. Once I've done that, I'm going to get it off the axle stands and get it outside and um, run it for a bit longer. <laughs> 